potion seller. Enough of these games. I'm going to battle. And I need your strongest potions. My strongest potions will kill you, traveler. You can't handle my strongest potions. You better go to a seller that sells weaker potions. Hey guys, Brain Nectar here, and I just wanted to announce that I'm working on redesigning the dragons uh, from Dragonology, as well as some of the creatures from Dungeons of Dragons. Uh, but for now, I'll try to work my way through the complete book of dragons. I may also try my hand at drawing creatures from the world of Dungeons of Dragons, like the um, uh, just some of the dragons from there, and some of the um, jelly monsters and uh, some of the giants but that might be done in another series we will see the first thing to think of when you're redesigning something is how can you make it different or better uh, how would something like this function in the real world um, would it look different now in this ever-changing world considering environmental factors um, Habitat changes and human activity. Alright, so the first dragon I uh, tried re. So, I've been looking over the style of the Dragonology books, and their dragons are more on the cartoon side than realism. Uh, they are. Um, done in the style of like children's illustrations but they're not most of them are not very realistic a few are but most of them are not uh, i'm gonna go try to go for a semi-realistic style the first dragon i began to redesign was the asian lung well known for uh in that region for being a sky god deity or a uh, water air elemental they reside mostly within the upper mountains of china and tibet and some are in Japan, um, but uh, to the mythology, I would think that they would be all over Asia. Um, I'm thinking this dragon is one of the more higher intelligent ones. It's definitely not like a drake or a worm. It's very expressive and intelligent, uh, being one of the older dragon species that can understand human languages, as well as its own dialects. Um, it's possible that this creature has probably carved or in some cases painted its history on the walls of some old sea or mountain caves or even some tempo temples. Caves or even some tempo temples. <laughs> 